I'm Angela Petrilli and I will be showing you one of my favorite, favorite techniques on guitar. It's hybrid picking. For this lesson, I have here a Martin Modern Deluxe 001228 with the Fishman Matrix Infinity VT installed. So hybrid picking, one of my favorite, favorite techniques on acoustic as well as electric, but man, does this, this so sings on an acoustic guitar. So hybrid picking, what is it exactly? Well, it's when we combine the sound of a pick on the strings and the sound of finger picking. So if I were just to play something, I want you to hear the difference, right? So I'm just gonna play a D and an A chord here only with the pick. Right, it's nice and bright, but when I take the pick away and I just use my fingers, it sounds something like this. Notice how it's a lot warmer, right? It's a lot more of a rounder sound. For me, when I'm playing, I like the sound of both. So with hybrid picking, it allows you to combine both of those sounds into one really cool and efficient technique. So here's how we get started with this. And again, this is the way that, that I like to do it. So I'm holding my pick with my thumb and my first finger. Thumb is going to be on the rounded part of the pick. All right, and if I flip that over slowly here, I've got my first finger here. Notice how it's oriented in the same direction as the pointed end of the pick. That's how I like to hold this, all right? There are many different ways to play a pick, but this is what works for me, all right? And then when we're talking about the finger picking section, I am using my middle finger and I'm always plucking upwards with that second finger on the string. And for this lesson, again, it's gonna be an introductory course into how to hybrid pick. So we're gonna take this nice and easy. So what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna have you play a D chord. First finger, second fret of the G string, that note is A. Your second finger, second fret of the E string, that note is F sharp, okay? And your third finger, reach over to the third fret of the B string, that note is D. So again, the one, three, five of this D major chord, they are all present here, D, F sharp, and A. So let's go ahead and start incorporating this hybrid picking, all right? We're on the ground level here. I'm gonna show you how to do this. So with the pick, strike the D string. And with your middle finger, strike upwards on the B string just like that. So let's go between those two. So pick and then that second finger. Okay, now for the second half of this chord we're gonna do here is get your pick, place it on the G string, pluck that. With your middle finger striking upwards on that F sharp note, second fret E string. All right, so when we combine the two, it's gonna sound like this. So now let's go ahead and move on to the A chord here. So here's what we're gonna do. Your second, third, and fourth finger, the fingers we're gonna use for this chord, all right? Your second finger, go ahead and place that on the second fret of the D string. That note is E, use an elephant. Your third finger, second fret of the G string, that's A, and your fourth finger, second fret of the B string, that note is going to be C sharp, all right? So what we're gonna do here, same thing, is kinda like that over under, right, every other string. So, pick plays the open A string. Your middle finger, go ahead and play the second fret of that G string. So like that, let's go ahead and do that a few times here. Now the next section we're going to do here, pick plays the D string, middle finger plays 
the B string. All right, so let's go ahead and combine those two parts together of this A chord. So now we'll do this next. We're gonna go to our D chord, then back to the A chord, all right? So now, back to the A chord. Let's go ahead and switch. Let's go ahead and do that one more time with each of the chords. D major. A major. So there you have it. There is an introduction to one of my favorite guitar techniques, hybrid picking. So if you'd like to learn more and check out the tab on this lesson, be sure to click the link in the video description. As always, wishing you all much success on your musical journeys, and I'll see you guys next time.